This isn't a devil binding ritual. It's a uh, a devil befriending ritual. <laughs> so accept my friend request now. I'm blocking you. Yeah. Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer, here with my lovely wife, Jenna Lee, on the ones and twos, and this is We Ain't Seen the Reactions, the place where we react to everything that we ain't ever seen. And if you read by the title, it's time to black out on everything with some more Black Clover reaction. Yeah, the last time we left off, man, we saw our boy Longris trying to figure out what he wants to do in the future because my boy, you know, he's on the combo. You know, he making waves, splashing and everything, got the drip on point. Got his necklace back and his confidence is at an all-time high. And he just so happens to be on the same ranking with Longris, which I forgot what the ranking was because I can honestly give two shits less. Superior I don't, or something, mother? Supreme? I don't know. Supreme Pizza, which I hate. And that's another reason why I hate him. But yeah, man, Longris was feeling some type of way, especially when he got people in this camp kind of saying how much they prefer you know over him and how much you know is just styling on him. So why wouldn't he feel some type of way? Short man syndrome, all this other shit with his brother. He had a lot going on. The girl that he don't even want, don't want him and want his brother instead, which I don't know why you'd be upset about that if you didn't really want it like that. But I guess it's just a man thing. Men fight over this type of stuff, I guess. Anyway, Longer sucks and uh, he's got <laughs> cool powers, but he's a shitty individual on more occasions than not. So anyway, yeah, he yeah. had to go on a journey and figure some stuff out exactly it's like he knew that he wanted to quit but he tried to use it as an excuse so he tried to lose to you know and stuff and you know what have none of that fakery it was like you gonna fight me one-on-one -on -one with the fair one or i'm gonna have to just whoop your ass and just send you back home running anyway so that's basically what happened and now this nigga, for some reason, he want to act like he want to fight for the uh, the princess or whatever her, her name was. Yeah, I don't want to just let you steal her from me easily like that. Right. So, uh, yeah, that was pretty much it. That was the gist of it all. Oh, yeah, then they went to the Heart Kingdom. Yeah, and they went back to the Heart Kingdom. They keep going back to this place, man. They better be some eventful. Boy, happening. they better train like they ain't never trained before. Because if they, uh, this old raggedy dude, the dude with them damn, wasn't it lightning powers or some shit he had? It's my luck. Or the dude no. that be over there. Yeah, he has some kind of lightning. Yeah, he sucks. Yeah, he do. He always does. Uh, acting like he ain't never seen nobody before. But uh, yeah, uh, with all that out of the way, let's go ahead and jump into this. This is going to be episode 155, titled The Five Spirit Guardians. So I guess we're going to see some of the other guardians besides the other dude. The Undertaker hat dude? Yeah, that might be a woman for all we know here. Yeah. Probably. But let's go, guys. Well, it's about time that you showed up. Get you next time. Yeah, you are. Training in another land. I wish Yami were here. By the way, Asta, you wanted me to give you a message. What is it? All he said was... I'll get stronger with my squad. Weird. Hmm. Not sure why he didn't want to come with us. He obviously would have learned a lot. Nah, you know's gonna get better no matter where he trains. I won't let him outdo me though. I see that you know this dude. I appreciate the invitation, sir. Come with me. The queen is waiting. I see a few new faces that I haven't had the pleasure of meeting. Welcome to the Heart Kingdom. Under normal circumstances, <laughs> she said she gonna get her food. She wasn't even supposed to come, was she? Not offer you more. Gaja, would you please explain? The first thing you all need to know is that Spade has already captured most of the Diamond Kingdom's bases, and that their invasion is at a standstill for right now. Mm. In other words, it won't be long before they decide to turn their focus on us or the Damn, they done fucked up shit like that. They got the Diamond Kingdom under their fucking toe. Subjecting each of you to rigorous training in order to accelerate your development. Sounds good to me. Let's go. It's not a problem. Hyperbolic time explain, chamber. It is imperative that we improve quickly. Then allow me to introduce the spirit guardians who will be teaching you. Let's go. The five heartbeats. Sourdough. It's nice to meet you. Sourdough. The guardian of plants, Potroff. Let's learn together. Okay. The guardian of fire, Floga. Work up a sweat. <laughs> guardian of wind, Smirk. Mm. Yeah, real daddy. You seem like a pretty serious crowd, huh? Oh man, I can't right. say which one of them I want to spar with most. Captain Charlotte and Lady Mimosa. I would like you both to begin your training with Sourdough. Understood, sir. Sourdough. Great, I'm looking forward to it. Finral, you'll be learning from Smirit first. Yes, sir! <laughs> Smirit! Finral, I'd like you to start with Potroff. Alright, let's get to it! I'll see you in the forest, then! 
I wonder if Real realizes that that girl that he has a crush on is sitting in, in the Queen's lap. No. Because she's not in her human form. I can't wait to meet the two of you. Luck here. They're always competing with each other. Anyway, I can train under you too so we can keep that going. Fine by me. Awesome. Well, okay. I don't really mind, but are you sure that you can hack it? Damn. <laughs> Y'all, it's down, my man, Magna. Permanently bound by the assignments I've chosen for you. Once your mana grows a bit, you'll move on to a different spirit guardian next to see what new insights they have to offer. That way, you can learn even more. Magic Knights, your training will begin now. Please don't let us down. Plants grow from the earth to strengthen plant-based magic. Okay, thickness. Dixness Magnus is almost. She reminds me of. I can't remember what her name. You're saying the first step is understanding yes. the earth. It's yeah. probably easier to explain if I give you a demonstration. Even the voice. Hey. Yeah. So this is what mages are capable of in the Heart Kingdom. Our magic attributes may be different, but we all need to be in tune with nature to use our spells. Should have brought old girl there too. The Costco look alike. Right, they got the same power. Display. Your magic type is similar, similar to that of one of my subordinates, but it's much faster and far more powerful than hers is. Damn. But then you were sent here instead. There must be a reason. I wonder. I mean, I'm sure Gata just figured we'd be a good match, is all. Oh shit. Well, it's your move. Yugi oh, no. Damn. Is this training? That's a dumb question, I know, but I really can't tell. Whether this is for this training, is murder. real battle. <laughs> the wind that blows between us the same. Don't you agree? I can't seem to figure this guy out. What is he acting so intense for? That's what I'd do. I thought that's what he was going to do. Clear. Perfect day for training. I Listen look to forward you. to working with you, Flogus, sir. Flogus. First things first. Let me see Buffus. your magic ability. Right, nigga, here. Don't look right on his body. Ability. Welterweight Fine. champion of the world. Alright, if this is what you can do at 80%, then I'd say you've got incredible potential. That's nice, but if you ask me, this isn't nearly good enough. I need to learn everything I can and get a whole lot stronger. I need to get my no way I'm more on point. This opportunity <laughs> go to waste. I need to look like a Super Saiyan 4. Also, I hope this doesn't come off as rude. But can you show me your powers too? Sorry, what? That way I can judge for myself whether I can learn much from you. Mm -hmm. Nigga. Uh, that makes sense. Hey, come on. Okay, then. You might be learning from a bonehead. You gotta know. <laughs> mm -hmm. Does that answer your question? Answer your question? <laughs> yes, I should have never doubted your strength. I apologize. Don't worry, I don't mind. The flame was so intense. I want to do that myself. This is a good spot. So, what are you going to teach me first? How to bask in natural mana. That voice does not match his looks. Water. I thought there was a woman so at first. This place is filled to the brim with life, which means it's also rich with mana. Now that you say something, I think I'm already getting a feel for it. Good. Never let go of that feeling. You need mono words in order to master our techniques. Listen close. Once you become one with natural mana, you'll be able to use those words for spells. This is cool. So this is like going to be a whole nother level of magic. Yeah. You mono words. A serious burst of inspiration. Then you should try it. Use mono words however your heart desires. It might not be perfect at first, but that's fine. He's positive too. Hey. Not bad. There were no mono words, but the need to create is welling up inside me. Wait, I've got an idea. I can see that you're an excellent painter, so let's try writing them this time instead. Look, think, read, and write. Like this? Uh oh! Whoa, Let's get that? it! Oh my! And 
after only seeing them one time. He's a captain. I keep forgetting that. Right. No, not the painting part. Thanks for your help, Potra. I think this masterpiece will be even better because of you. Not the point. <laughs> right. Hey, you're one of the black balls, right? Actually, I know her as Queen Laura Pechka's pet. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> her guest, of course. <laughs> Weren't you eating back at the palace? Well, yeah, but I kind of sort of ate everything they had there, so I figured I might as well go searching for new and undiscovered. Why don't you cook your own shit? Yeah, she thought it was real. Palace supply. He's looking right at the love of his life, and he won't even know. Since you traveled all this way to the Heart Kingdom, how would you like to learn some of our special combat techniques? That doesn't really line up with my goal of eating all the delicious noms I can find. Oh, don't see that way. Look, these are called mono words. They often come in handy. Right, girl, you can make you some soul food, dip. Wow, we've got another prodigy. But your execution could still use some work. The secret to that is you have to be in touch with the natural mother. There must be more succulent fruit somewhere in these woods! I bet if we venture a bit deeper into the forest, I'll find some scenery that really gets my creative juices flowing! I'm begging you, just listen to me for a few minutes, please. Nigga, <laughs> we ain't trying to hear it. We trying to eat and draw, okay? I'm ready to learn from you and Undine. Of course. But first, there's something I'd like to bring to your attention. I need you to rescue me. If nothing changes, I'll be killed by this curse. Oh, Soon. what you gonna do? Take the seal okay. off of her or something? Stop the devil before that happens. That's why we came here to train. We are the ones who will defeat Megicula. Uh, uh, sorry, could you explain what you mean by that? Obviously, striking down the Spade Kingdom's invasion will require the help of the other Magic Knights, but... Megicula's inside someone. An extremely powerful mage. Her name is Banneka. Banneka? The only way we'll even stand a chance against uh -oh. her is if Undine and I work together with... Looking like an apostle from Berserk. And you already have an idea of what this Vanica person can do, is that it? She sounds pretty tough. Well, since I'm the water spirit, it's my job to fight alongside the queen and to protect her from danger. But the two of us were no match for Vanica's astounding power. Goddamn Vanica. Because of my weakness, her majesty must live in fear of her impending death. No, please don't ever blame yourself for my curse, Undine. A person who has been possessed by a devil cannot be defeated by normal means. I get it. So by teaming up with me and Nero, you get some kind of special advantage that should be enough to stop her, right? We can't be sure of that just yet. But I've come to the conclusion that the four of us working together creates the best possible scenario for Yeah, them. strength in numbers, man. Noel, I hope the two of you will agree to cooperate with us and save Lord Petchka's life. With Nero's arcane stage spells and your combative spirit and fighting style, <laughs> if we four train hard, then we'll become a formidable team. And then hopefully, we can overpower Vanica and Megicula. Let's get it. All of that makes sense to me. Nero, can we count you in too? We're grateful. No need for that. Trust me. Like how both of them got burned themed dresses. Megicula. Good, then we agree. Let's begin our training. <laughs> Hey, that's Go cool. Ahead and back. <laughs> this nigga ain't open his ass, yeah. But if you can't it won't help you. Come on, Finn. You can't support anybody like this. Ooh. Great work, ladies! Just keep on using those mana words! I know you'll get the hang of it eventually! Right, you can't just be swinging all over the place. 
A fighting style that relies solely on your grit and determination is not enough to sustain you forever. To truly unleash your abilities, it's only logical that you use them to back up your allies as well. Let me try one more time! I suppose you won't be satisfied with that advice alone. <laughs> We'll see about that. And they're already running me ragged. And it's not just me, it's all of us. So, are you seeing any progress? It looks like everybody's got the hang of the Heart Kingdom special techniques. If it's like this every day, I'd be surprised if we weren't crazy tough at the end. Great. Well, keep it up then. Right. Looks like they're all working hard to push past their limits. So I guess I better up my game as well. There you go, man. Get your mana skin on. A little mana condom. But guys, that's episode one. Was it one fifty five? That was a pretty good episode, man. I like how they've all been paired up with people with similar abilities to them. Like um, the only wild card is Austin, which is a given because he doesn't have mana like that. So it's going to be interesting seeing how he adapts to these situations. You know, he's going to actually have to learn how to combat the mana words, which is this new level of magic usage. You know, I, I, I really liked it. I was wondering if he was going to get anything different because... That's one thing about Shonen. They always try to bring something new to the table. Like for One Piece, you have to double fruit and then you realize that, oh, it's more to that. We got something called hockey, which allows us to like harden our fist and make all this other shit. So yeah, it's cool that they learn how to do this shit. What you think about this episode, Big Head? Um, I thought it was a pretty neat, absent episode. <coughs> <coughs> oh my God. <coughs> <coughs> Let me clear my... Going. Right, no, I thought it was a pretty good episode. Um, looks like they're all learning some new stuff, and hopefully, this is actually helpful. I see what people were saying when they were like, Yeah, the real training begins in the 150 area. Yeah, so yeah, it looks like they're really training to try to. But now we have a we've met a there's a new demon that it's not just Magicula, it's Vanica, and it's I was confused about that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll get more insight on it in the next episode, though. Yeah, we're gonna probably see similar characters that have you know basically kind of like Asta except it seems like the devil within them has more uh, possession over them as opposed to Asta who's basically utilizing the devil's attributes so that's going to be interesting seeing how those characters do or if that even reveals more about those type of characters because that's one thing that I'm interested in seeing what are these devils like what's their origin I know we have the one devil that tried to take over the Clover King like, what shit. is their end goal yeah. well, we kind of knew what his end goal was kind of but right. what are these other people these other devils end goal are they all connected are they all from the same devil family it seems mm -hmm. like they are are they related to Asa yeah I'm looking forward to seeing that too maybe that's going to reveal Asta's father or one of his relatives yeah because it's like we kind of got some information about Yuno's family mm -hmm. but not Asta, so I'm like, I'm wondering if that's, you know, we're gonna find that out. So, but to be fair though, we haven't gotten like details on Uto's. Oh, what am I saying? Uto, Uto goddamn it! I don't know why I'm saying Uto. I'm, I'm probably still thinking about fucking Jujutsu Kaisen Yuta, but no, uh, Uto's um, paternal family, the ones that basically rebirthed him since he's like a reincarnated version of. Lit sun. Yeah, we don't. We still. Yeah, it's still kind of vague for both of them, but we don't know anything about Asta like at all. Mm -mm. Yeah, I'm wondering if we're gonna get more insight on that. Right, these comrades like they got to call each other. But yeah, guys. Um, I guess I can give that one a, a just a flat out. Probably even a yeah. Yeah. So we are gonna keep it pushing with the next episode, which is episode 156, titled "Awakening Powers." Let's get it. with this guy for days now and I still can't get a single hit in. Wait, he got three swords now, don't he? Yeah. To hold back. You'd be in far worse shape. If I was him, I would absorb the energy and send it you back. You to your physical limit, obtain the rare power known as anti-magic, and forge friendships with capable allies. That's gotten you this far. You got a bat wing? However, it won't be and enough to overcome more. the enemy that we're about to face. If you can't find a way to defeat me in one-on-one -on -one combat, you will fall to the Spade Kingdom Devil. One more round. Let's go. <laughs> the hell? Lava Golems? Flame magic! Kalidos Brachium! <laughs> Hot 
down here. Hey, Siskolion, good to see you. The name is Mara Leona, as you know. Did you come for Millie a dip in the mayonnaise? Do your part and clear out some of the locals before. Sure, I'll take it a dip in there with you, girl. So you killed those magical beasts just to make sure they wouldn't interrupt your bath? You are every bit as violent as I remember you being. Not like it was a big chore. I wouldn't even call that a warm up. Of course not. Tell you what, though. If you need a warm up, you can fight me. Let's go. Let's did you come all this way looking for me? Hey, y'all gonna yeah, fight, all right. Mm -hmm. We know what that See, means. See, when I was fighting that word devil, I was able to use a technique of yours. I think you call it monosome. But I don't have a good handle on how it works just yet. Now we're really Let's dead. go. Something tells me I could get more use out of it if I did. Oh, are you scared me? You said it's all right. Uh-huh. Couldn't you do that alone? This man long as I'll be black as far. I was hoping you'd be willing to show me the ropes. Yeah, even my boy get training. I was thinking that I should get some more training. Everybody in. training. But be warned. Against me? You must just burn! Mm. Before you even get to try my technique! Oh boy. I'm not sure if she sees the difference between teaching me and killing Hot me. Hot Cheeto challenge, let's go! I think I'll just go! <laughs> That's probably not gonna fly, is it? You're the one who chose to bring fresh meat into a lion's den. Mm. Well, I guess it's best for you to come at me with some murder. Wait, pull that sword out quick. You do. How else am I supposed to push past my limits? Very well. I'll call you to a crisp. But I'll be Chaco. I don't think about Naruto. Chakra. Oh, Chakra. I'm about to say what? Chocolate detection. I can detect the first step of the mana method you don't say that. is to feel the mana mm -hmm. flowing around you. So perhaps you should try something similar. Right. I need to feel the flow of anti magic. <laughs> She's faster than I can track. Is this all you got? Think you can dodge your way to victory? Mm. What the hell is she this fast? <sighs> no worries. Thanks to her monosome, then I should be able to match her. We'll see, nigga. You want to see what monosome can do? I'll show you. I want that nigga to be without his sword. Well, this is good. <laughs> you know you gonna take it from Yami? Yeah, he got to, man. I've already seen the powers of the Demon Slayer sword and the Demon Destroyer sword. I assume that this sword is unique as well. Yeah. Right. The Demon Dweller sword it probably has powers that I haven't drawn out. Yes. Yet. That reminds me. Right after I found this sword, I channeled Noel's mana with it. Uh, that's what I'm saying. He hasn't used shit in so long. Then I say he's gonna absorb the energy. Mm -hmm. Interesting. You look like you right. Suck my ball. Please let me have another try. That's what you want. I'll take suck my balls for five hundred Alex. If you manage to land a single hit on me, then I'll declare you victorious. Be honest! I wish you'd just go all out! If you won't move, I'll bring the fight to you! <laughs> See? She's using like little flame platforms. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think he was gonna do? She's gonna order the shit out of you. You don't right? do something. I would now boy the shit out of you. Just to keep increasing 
my speed with monosome. So stop her from throwing that enemy new spell. You're not that! You developed a rudimentary grasp of how to use monosome! Which means I can stop holding back now! <laughs> you seriously think you were holding back before? No way! This gift is to thank you for the good time! Do your best not to let it kill you! Thank you, you for being a friend! I like how she did that. Eh? Lions roar! I'm not sure I can stop all that, but I can. I have to. Oh no shit! No point in asking if I can. I have to, so I will. Right here, right now. I'll push past my limits. Monster, dark magic, black hole. Hmm. <laughs> Dude, that's cool. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get out of here. Oh. I like it. Got him. <laughs> Got him. Right. Quite At first, I thought he was going to absorb the energy from the incoming blast, yeah, but he used his own energy. So, what did he do? Use the anti magic in the air? Yeah, he just absorbed his dark magic and used his projectile. Terrified. Catch you later! Hmm. 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 Hmm.
<laughs> Why does it just keep reminding me of the last kingdom? They look like Uhtred Finning and goddamn Citric on the heel. Plotting. But remember, only one of us needs to reach the Clover Kingdom. As long as one of us makes it, there's hope. Hang on to that hope no matter what happens. Let's go! Ninja Run. <sighs> look at that. We found ourselves a pack of stray rebels. <sighs> Your friend ratted you out, but that isn't too surprising. Boy, with friends like that. Mm -hmm. life on the line. Run for it. If I bring your heads back to my superior, I'll get a promotion and a raise for sure. <laughs> Don't turn your back to me. Yeah. Come on, man. I don't even know y'all, but at least do something to impress me. Wow. Boy, Uther would have never got caught out like that. Desperate bomb. I'll reach the Clover Kingdom, no matter what it takes. The strong magic region is just past this cliff. Can I really cross it? Stop that. Don't let this sacrifice go to waste. You can do it. Follow in your father's footsteps. You can't give up. <laughs> there he is. Get him! I can't let them take me. I'm the last hope. Last hope, last hope. Better find something to do. Whoop. Well, who? You know. Who hit him? I couldn't tell. But even if he's alive, that's a strong magic region. The environment will kill him before long. We'll see. I don't know about you two, but I'd rather not chase him. Yeah, he'll die soon. Serves him right. Damn resistance. Let's <laughs> go. I see these niggas is arrogant. I'm a bow leg and walk. Who knows what will happen if we stay too long? <laughs> Nothing good. Well, like a loop in the third character. Say this is the son of one of the mage defense forces' former commanders. Yes, we interrogated one of the rebel conspirators we captured and learned that his name is Ralph. And sir, his name actually appears in. It a matters not. Let this fly buzz around as he will. We'll swat him down if he decides. They got my nigga Dio. Doing the voice of this character. That's cool. Right, like it's twerking, like. <laughs> Not only you thought that. It did, like it was twerking. It's like, oh, I'm finna pop that thing. I'm finna pop this way. But uh, yeah, guys, that was episode 151, man. Like we getting close to some epic shit and some more badass characters, man. Like the the Spade Kingdom, they are obviously a very arrogant and cocky kingdom, which you know I guess they have every right to be because they are taking over one step at a time or one kingdom at a time. But uh, yeah, you know, I'm liking how far they're coming. Everybody seems to have better experience with this mono word system and Asta. I think his problem, like I said during the reaction, is that he needs to master his abilities or become more familiar with them in order to uh, stand yeah. a chance. I'm like, don't you have anti magic, which is a thing? Like, you got the anti magic swords, but like, don't you have like you possess anti magic, or is it only with the sword? But like you said, it's like a all he know how to do is wave the sword around, not right. utilize the anti-magic itself. Seems yeah, because like. I remember, um, I think it was uh, your boy Liam, or uh, L-E-M, L -E he had said, hey man, don't get too hyped about that ability. You might not be seeing it for a while, and I see what they meant by that, because he's just now using this ability, and I've been wondering why it's taking him so long to utilize, because I was like, only thing that you're going to be able to do is try to hit him with a projectile. You're not going to be able to get him close quarters mm -hmm. like that, so it was cool to see him remember that like he needs to stop thinking of brute force and use tactics you know what I'm saying stop it get some, some help oh, oh yeah get some anti-magic that's right but uh yeah it's gonna be interesting seeing this character I forgot his name is that that ain't McGickula is it I don't think so that seemed like McGickula looked more 
we only seen him from behind, but he looked more right. menacing than that. Right, right, yeah. I wonder if, like, once Asta meets one of these other devil harbingers and shit, if his devil is going to act like that. Hey. Right. Man, that's my cousin Clyde. The nigga still owe me some money. You know what I'm saying? Might be on some shit like that. So it's gonna be interesting seeing that, man. But I have been addicted to these last couple yeah, episodes. Yeah, really good. It's crazy. We're almost at the end. I know, right? It's like you guys have just watched us grow into these right awesome reaction channel, and we just appreciate you all. But anyways, we're going to turn it over to you guys. If there's anything we may have missed or we may have talked over, always feel free to provide context in the comment section below. But this is your boy, RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer. Love the wife, John Lee on the ones and two diddles. We ain't seen any reactions. We'll catch you guys on the next reaction too. Black Clover. Peace.